Hey guys, it's Aaron from Bad Bass Fishing. Before we get into today's video, I, I'm like I'm in the middle of editing it, but I forgot to say I hope you guys had an amazing Thanksgiving. Hope you guys got filled up on turkey, mashed potatoes, all the good stuff, and hopefully you guys got some Black Friday shopping done. So I hope you guys enjoy today's video. What is going on, you bad basses out there? Welcome back to another episode with Bad Bass Fishing. Today's video is sponsored by Mystery Tackle Box. If you guys don't know what Mystery Tackle Box is, let me tell you all about it. So Mystery Tackle Box is a monthly subscription to tackle or fishing tackle. And what you do is you sign up and you can get like a one month, three month, six month, or 12 month, I believe, subscription. And they send you a box every month to your doorstep full of juicy, succulent lures that will catch monster fish any time of the day, any day of the year. They actually, I'm pretty sure, like pick out these lures themselves based off of your location, what species you're targeting, and the time of year. So like right now, it's fall, deep fall, kind of early winter. We're kind of transitioning over to winter. It's 70 degrees one day here in Missouri and then 22 the next, so not really sure what you would call that. But we're gonna do a little unboxing and then after this, we're gonna, I'm going to need your guys' help with a project I'm gonna start. And today's video is gonna be kind of mellow, laid back. Um, the weather's kind of gross. Uh, it's very chilly, kind of windy. It was raining and yeah, it's just not a very good day to go fish. So it's gonna be more of a vlog style video and we're gonna get into it. So we're gonna open up our box here and one of the first things on top is your doubles digest. And I believe this is just, let's see here. It just tells you, like, gives you tips and stuff about how to fish and catch fish and all that good stuff. And that's one of the best parts about Mystery Tackle Box is that if you don't know how to fish or you don't know how to fish certain things, they send you all these lures and they tell you how to fish them and it helps you become a better fisherman in general. Therefore, it is the best fishing subscription box in the world. The next thing is we got ourselves a six sticker from Catch Co. I love stickers. I'm a huge fan of stickers and I love every Mystery Tackle Box sticker. And then you got a what's inside the box uh, list here. It tells you what's inside um, and the prices. So like this box is, I think it goes for $26 and let's see here, 12, 20. I've got about 45, $50 worth of stuff in this box. So it's a heck of a deal and you guys should check them out. The next thing is, all right, we got our sales. A chatterbait, like a bucktail chatterbait. It's more like a, it is a chatterbait, but it's got like a hair jig on the back, which is pretty neat. Let me see if I can give you a better view of it here. Come on, focus, focus, focus. There we go. And then, that is by Z-Man, and of course, it comes paired up with some Z-Man Streak Z or Streaks Curly Tails. Look at there. Match the hatch. A little trailer for your little chatterbait there. Next thing is, we got ourselves a Carolina rig kit, which is pretty sick. Comes with the weights, the beads, some weights, and uh, some swivels. Next thing in our box, we got ourselves a Buya hard knocker, which is a lipless crankbait. Come on, focus camera, you can do it. There we go. A little lipless crankbait, which is an amazing fall time lure. One of my favorites by far. Next thing in our box, we got some Rage Tail, a uh, little cross. They're coffee scented, pretty neat. That'll be good on the back of a jig. I love throwing jigs in the fall. It's one of the top baits. And if you guys want to see what my favorite uh, baits are, my top five favorite baits specifically for the fall, I'll link a video down below and maybe somewhere up here. The next thing is we got some Carl's Amazing Baits. Uh, I don't know what these are actually called. I don't see the name. Let's see. Flicker worms. We got some flicker worms here. I think that'll pair up with the old Carolina rig real nicely. And Fishing real slow and fishing that gravel, it'll help you catch lots of fish. And the last thing in our box is a jerk bait. One of the greatest all time lures in the world. Maybe, maybe, I don't know. Anyways, it is a really good winter lure. I love throwing this when it gets super cold out, when the water temperatures drop really low. The jerk bait is always a go to, like the fall, the winter. You know, you're going for reaction strikes. The fish, not really on that feeding pattern. So, you know, you gotta get a reaction strike and a jerkbait is one of the best ways to do it. 
so that is what's in this month's mystery tackle box. A bunch of good stuff, like always. I've been getting mystery tackle boxes for quite some time now, and not once have they disappointed me. So that is a mystery tackle box, and if you guys would like to try try out mystery tackle box yourself, I will leave a link down in the descri description below the video. And if you click on that link and get yourself a mystery tackle box, it supports me, supports mystery tackle box, and it helps the channel grow. And that would be amazing. So thank you. Next thing on the list, project talk. Let me fix my camera here. Wow, it is cold. All right, so this is this is the project. We got this big log thing. Or we got this big thing here. It's upside down right now, but it is a uh, stand to a big fish tank. I just got it for free, so shout out to Caitlin from the barbershop if you're watching this video. Thank you so much. So, of course, with the stand, we got ourselves a giant fish tank. And you guys know I've had pet fish before, and I bought, like, a little 20-gallon tank. But now we've got the big stuff. I need your help figuring out what fish I want to put in this tank. I believe it's, like, a 45 or 55-gallon tank. It's pretty long. I think it's, like, God, I think it's, like, four foot long, and probably about 14, 15 inches wide, but I want your guys' help choosing what fish I'm gonna put in here because I'm gonna take this stand, clean it all up, clean the tank out, clean all the glass, repaint it or restain it, make it look super snazzy, and we're gonna fill it with some pretty sick fish. So you guys, with I need your help right here. I need you to go down in the comments below and name a fish that you want me to put in this. And who knows, maybe we'll just fill this sucker full of crazy exotic fish and I mean if I get the fish that you guys choose I'll like I don't know I'll comment or reply to your comment and I'll let you name them and everything I'll mention you in the video give you like a little shout out and that'll be pretty sick I think so I want to get this thing cleaned up get it nice and I don't know dolled up I guess just make it look real real juicy on the inside and fill it with some fish that you guys would like to see. And then we can do some fish tank videos. Like, now that I got a bigger tank, we can do, like, feeding videos again. Like, I think those would be pretty sick. And, yeah, that's where I need your help. And if you guys, like, have any uh, recommendations on what to put in here, like, decal-wise or decoration-wise, like, plants, blah, 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 whatever. Or if you want to send me something, let me know in the comments below. If you need to get a hold of me for whatever reason... My socials are also down below in the description. Just DM me on Twitter, Instagram, add me on Snapchat. It's whatever. I always reply to everybody, and I love talking to you guys. So that is our big project right here, the old fish tank. It's really cold out, so I don't know when I'm going to get this done. But I think if I can get this done, we'll be able to get some sick videos out of some super sick fish that you guys want me to put in here. So I think we're going to end today's video here. I know it was really short, and I'm sorry, but... Yesterday's video, because this is, I believe, I'll get this out by Saturday. Today will be Saturday when you're watching this. But yeah, I know the upload schedule says Friday, Tuesday and Fridays. But my hunting video that I was editing with my little brother and my big brother, I took them hunting. Um, we didn't, we saw a couple deer, but Jeff never shot one. Steven, we, yeah, we had some bad luck. We're not going to talk about it. But I'm going to take Steven hunting again here during youth season, hopefully get him connected. But my footage was corrupted, so I wasn't able to get out a video. So this is why I'm filming it right now. It's literally Friday. Video is supposed to be up in like two hours. But <sighs> the struggle of having awful Wi-Fi and bad luck with corrupted footage. So, like I said, get ready for some sick videos. I think I might make a video. I don't know. I might film myself like cleaning this stuff up. If you guys are interested in that, leave a thumbs up. And if we get like 20 likes, I'll make a video where I like clean it up and take you guys along for the journey of getting this sucker prepared for the awesome fish that you guys are going to want me to put in here. So we're going to end today's video and I hope you guys enjoyed. Sorry it was so short, but got to do what you got to do. I'll catch you guys on the next episode of Bad Best Fishing. And folks, like always, stay on.